Hello, my name is Juliana Corral. I didn't know who uh, who she was because she missed like the first part of the internship. I joined the program late because I had a bunch of issues with my papers. She was having trouble, right? And I was just, like talking to her, helping her, to, uh, helping her through it. Yeah, just be, being the the ear she needed. And then I realized, oh, I I just put a lot of things on my plate. I am in my senior year of high school. I didn't know what I wanted to do. I didn't know if I wanted to take a gap year or study sociology in a public university back home. Those were my two options. But then one of my professors after a speech contest in English, a teacher approached me and she was like, you should take a look in this program. It's called United World Colleges that have a mission to unite people and nations and students from all over the world, to know each other, understand that we are all different, and then hopefully achieve peace. I got a, a scholarship, a full scholarship, to go to study in UWC Changshu, which is in China. And that decision completely changed my life. And I was like a little bit undecisive of whether or not to go, but I decided to just just to jump in the unknown and go to China for two years. I went more for the experience of traveling, but something that I didn't know um, is that we receive funding to study in the United States. So after I graduated UWC, I got a scholarship in the United States to study here uh, in Lake Forest College. Basically it's a program that you study in the city, like you come live in the city, uh, well, you have an internship in my case is the university. It has been a roller coaster completely because um, I always thought that I was going to do sociology, but the idea of like writing papers and academic things to just an elite group of people to read and, and discuss didn't sit right with me. I realized that my channel to to convey all these things was through film and audiovisual arts and photography. They also make me realize how much of a challenge it is to access the film industry, especially as a, as a woman from Latin America who doesn't have a citizenship, you know.